Hey there, CFIS. This is Mrs. Reed. You know, as I sit down this morning for yet another day of online school, it has me thinking about next year and how exciting it must be for you guys to think about rejoining your classmates and your teachers once again. It's also an exciting time to think about music. This is the first time that you guys have the chance to choose which music class you want to take. You can choose general music, choir, band, or orchestra. That can be a hard decision. So your teachers have put together a fabulous slideshow presentation that outlines all the cool things about each of these programs. There are lots of links and videos with lots of information for you to review with your parents so that you can make the best decision for you. There's also a form for you to fill out and that form helps us schedule your classes for next year. So please make sure you go to your music Google Classroom check out the slideshow, and make sure you fill out that form, which is due May 18th. Now here's Mrs. Carricker with more information about orchestra. Hi everyone, I'm Mrs. Carricker, the orchestra director for Chagrin Falls Schools. I teach all of the orchestras here in Chagrin. Some of you may have an older sister or brother in the orchestra program, and I teach them too. So I teach all four of the string instruments, the violin, the viola, the cello and the double bass. So please remember to check all of the links and choose the instrument that you think sounds the best. At this time, I'm gonna turn it over to Mrs. Smith about the choir and general music program. Bye. Hi, fourth grade. You obviously know me, Mrs. Smith here to tell you about what I teach in fifth and sixth grade. I teach the fifth and sixth graders general music and I also teach choir. So what is general music? Well, it's a continuation of what you have done so far, but we get much, much more involved. You are going to be creating ensembles, so creating music using xylophones, using recorders, using drums. We play games, we do movement, it's a lot of fun. Um, and that's, like I said, the class for the students that really aren't that don't have a top priority um, as far as being on stage. So if you're not a person that really likes to go out on stage and perform, general music is absolutely for you. Those of you who absolutely love to sing, well, I want you to join the choir. We've got a choir that meets during fifth grade encore and then one that meets during sixth grade encore. And a lot of times those choirs do sing together. I'll talk about the select choir at the end. Next, I would like to introduce you to Ms. Schoenfeld and Mr. Subnoski, and they are going to tell you a little bit more about the band. Don't forget to check out all of the links that are in the letter and all of the links that are in my slide presentation. It's very important. And here's Ms. Schoenfeld and Mr. Subnoski. Well, hello, fourth graders and parents. I am Ms. Schoenfeld and I teach the band instruments here at the Chagrin Falls Schools. If your brother or sister plays a band instrument, then odds are that I get to see them every single day in class. Just like next year, I will get to see you when you have band, along with Mr. Szymnowski, who will talk a little bit about the band instruments. Hi there, my name is Mr. Szymnowski, and along with Ms. Schoenfeld, I am the other band director. Uh, in fifth grade band, you can choose from the flute, the clarinet, the alto sax, the trumpet, the trombone, or percussion to play. So we hope you check out the links, listen to those instruments, and uh, find the one you like the sound of the best. Uh, I'm now going to turn it over to Mrs. Smith, who's going to tell you about a special choir at the intermediate school. Hi, fourth grade. It's Mrs. Smith again, here to tell you about an extra special group we have at the intermediate school. It's the Chagrin Falls Intermediate School Select Choir. This group this year was made up of 48 students, there were about 19 or 20 boys in it. It was so exciting to have that many students and especially that many boys. So I can't wait to see how many audition for next year. I know there are a lot of students out there that were in Tiger Beats. Now Tiger Beats was anybody joins. This one you do have to try out for, okay? And auditions will be in the fall. To be eligible to try out for the select choir, you have to either take choir, band or orchestra during the school day. If you sign up for either one of those for fifth grade, you 
are welcome to audition for this group. This group does extra special performances throughout the community, along with our two concerts that all of the kids do that are in a performing ensemble. Um, please make sure that if you are interested on the Google form that's in your Google Classroom for music course selections, check off that you're interested in auditioning so that I can make sure to get the information out to you and your parents in the fall when we return to school. I'd like to hand it back over to Mrs. Reed so that she can conclude our presentation. Well, there you have it. Now all you have left to do is read through the material, listen to the links, and fill out the course selection form, which is due May 18th. We are so excited to have these many fabulous opportunities for you for music. If you have any questions, just reach out to your teachers. Their information is included in the packet. Have a great day, CFIS. Thanks for watching.